In this question, we have a thin walled spherical vessel which contains a pressure P and has an inner radius R and a wall thickness T. Our goal is to find the change in radius and then the change in wall thickness. Let's start with part A. Change in radius. which is delta R. We know that for spherical vessels, sigma theta is equal to PR over 2T, and it is equal to sigma X. And we also know that sigma R is equal to zero. For change in radius, we will need to find epsilon theta, because we know that Delta R over R is equal to epsilon theta and it is equal to 1 over E times sigma theta minus Poisson's ratio sigma X plus sigma R from generalized Hooke's law. We know that sigma R is 0 so we will simplify the equation and we will get epsilon 0 is equal to 1 over E times sigma theta minus Poisson's ratio times sigma x. And this is again equal to delta R over R. When we make some arrangements, we got delta R is equal to R over E times sigma theta minus Poisson's ratio times x. We know the equation for sigma theta and we know that it is equal to sigma x. So we will substitute the equation here, which gives us this equation. Let's make the arrangements so that we get delta R is equal to pressure times radius square times 1 minus Poisson's ratio over 2 times Young's modulus times thickness. We found the change in radius. Now we can find the change in wall thickness. which is delta t. For delta t, we will need epsilon r. We know that delta t over t is equal to epsilon r. And it is equal to 1 over e times sigma r minus Poisson's ratio times sigma x plus sigma theta. Again, we know that sigma r is 0 and this will give us epsilon r is equal to 1 over e times minus Poisson's ratio times sigma x plus sigma theta. And it is also again equal to delta t over t. Then we got Delta T S T over E times minus Poisson's ratio times sigma X plus sigma theta. We know that sigma X and sigma theta are equal, and again they are equal to PR over 2T. I will write them here. Let's make the simplifications and we will get delta T is equal to minus Poisson's ratio times pressure times radius over Young's modulus. And that's all.